Hello guys and welcome to another track guide video and today we got Mount Panorama in group 3 and for this track guide video I decided to go with the Supra so I'm using GR Supra while running the racing soft tires of course in the race you got available racing soft and racing mediums so we just try to last as long as you possibly can on the racing soft I'll try to explain everything as best as I possibly can but this track is very very hard and yeah without further ado let's get going Start in the lap and as usual try to carry as much speed as you possibly can out of the last turn and break when you see this guy taking a photo so I'm actually using him as some kind of a reference break it's kind of in between the 50 and 100 meter sign but I'm using him because it's much better for me and it's always there uh, downshifting into second and quickly upshifting into third gear so you want to get a little bit of a slide to get the most out of that turn I didn't quite did it in the perfect way so there's a lot more time to be gained and this one maybe even up to a tenth so be careful try to carry and as usual try to carry that uh, speed onto the straight so here another reference is the beginning of the grass on the left and this really this is really important try to ride the curb but not too much so if you ride the curb too much you will get a slide but again you don't really want to do it too slow otherwise you will again lose time so it's kind of in the middle of using the line or not so here uh, reference on the right is my turning point so no lift and no breaking before the shadow in front of me and then going in here uphill try to not break the car too much so it's mainly about trail breaking uphill so I don't really have a reference apart from that apex and here I'm using the tree as my turning point again try to not lift so uh, here if you lose even a I would say even a half a tenth here on this uphill section by the end of this uh, section you will lose up to a tenth maybe tenth and a half here just a quick lip lift before the curb starts and the same thing here just a quick lift try to carry as much speed as you possibly can and get as close as you can to that wall I know it's a bit hard so sometimes taking a bit easy it's not it's not really a bad idea now the Audi sign and look at my braking I'm working my way with the brakes uh, lifting actually you got to be progress progressive while you downshift and not use too much braking while you turn in otherwise the car will slide too much and you will not be able to control it so take it easy and only brake when the car is straightened up similar situation here um, I'm actually turning at this uh, auto sign and also looking at this transition and this is the point where I usually start to brake bringing the car straight and then turning in so it's not really a sliding section and I actually touched the wall there so I lost a bit of time in the end it was okay but I think this lap can definitely get under 59s I think 58 my optimum time was 58.7 so there's a lot more to be gained in this lap alone and as I said before try to carry as wide as possible entry so you can carry a lot more speed uh, onto this long straight and here I'm actually looking at the sign because it says the sign in between the 100 and the 150 rather than 125 I would say break there downshift quickly into second and not a lot of troll braking gotta gotta say and quickly up to third gear and try to I would say try to avoid that curb because it can give you a little slide uh, once you get over it but I think most of the time it won't so here I'm looking at looking at that tree tree is actually my reference breaking at about 80 meters I would say and again not a lot of trail braking you actually want to let go the let go off the brakes and let the car do the turn uh, pretty much on its own and this was 59006 I missed out on that 58 by six thousandths of a second I did like a 45 minutes after this but it wasn't just wasn't that good I always made a mistake somewhere but this lap seriously has a potential to get in the 58s and I definitely think I will get it by the end of the week so guys uh, if you like the video smash the like button and thank you very much for watching this Bye.